Hello, hello. This is Salvatore D'Angelo, also known as Sal U Loans, coming in today with a market update. Um, we're going to talk a little bit about real estate. That's what I do. I'm a loan officer. I deal with this stuff all day. Okay. I see it a million times a day. Um, questions about credit, questions about more specifically getting into a home for the first time. There is no reason why you shouldn't be buying a house right now. Um, so many programs out there to make it easy for you. Um, you've got down payment assistance programs where they're actually going to cover, you know, most of your closing costs and down payment. Um, that's a great program. If you can, though, you probably want to go straight to an FHA or a conventional loan, um, get you into a house with as little as 3.5% down or 3% down if you do go conventional. Um, flip that rent into some equity uh, in a home, you know, pay into your own dream. It's time to, you know, get away from paying into somebody else's dream. Um, set your family up for the future. Um, generational wealth is very important, especially nowadays where, you know, the market um, is volatile. Uh, some things, you know, pandemic uncertainty in life, money always makes things a little easier. So, what do you need to get into a loan? Okay, you need to be at your job for two years or within your industry. Um, if you have a business, you need to have filed taxes for two years. Um, you need a credit score above 620. There are some other programs out there for scores lower than that. But to be honest with you, I know credit repair people. You want to get credit repair until you're above 620, and it's just going to be a more beneficial loan for um, you and your family, right? So it's about making money. It's about setting yourself up for the future. Um, you want to go through these programs in great detail. You want to talk to somebody who knows uh, what they're doing that does this every day so you can make the best decision for your family. Um, inventory is up. 11% uh, from last year. So what does that mean to you? There are more opportunities for you to get a home right now compared to last year. Um, if you were in real estate last year, you remember that the 20 to 50 offers on a single home, how hard it was for your client to get an offer accepted. Not to say that it's easy now because it's not. It's still a very competitive market. But there are more opportunities out there right now for uh, first time buyers. And a common question I get uh, from first time buyers, is it a good time? It is a good time because as you can see with the rates here, over here, right? Rates are still low. These homes are going to continue to appreciate for two to three more years. Um, so the price of the home isn't going down and the cost of the money is going up. So the sooner you can get in, the better it's going to be. I, again, it's about setting up yourself with wealth in the future. That's what appreciation does for you and your family. Um, paying into something that's going to pay you back one day. Uh, that's what it's all about. Um, as far as questions that you might have about other scenarios that aren't as general as the ones that I'm um, asking or talking about now, feel free to message me. I'm always here for you guys. Um, newer realtors that, you know, maybe you don't understand something as far as um, the contracts go or, you know, when you're submitting an offer or you have questions about the market or how you should suggest um or what you should suggest to your clients, feel free to reach out to me. If your loan officer isn't always there for you as a real estate agent, you need a, a new loan officer. And they have this guy out there, his name's Sal U Loans, and that's probably who you should go with.